You ever had a kid giving the wrong answer? You ask a question, making an inference, and kids giving the wrong answer. You ever do this? Mm, anybody else? Anybody else? Helping out Jonathan? Right? Okay, here's what we just did. We just stole from Jonathan the opportunity to fix up his own misunderstanding. No, hold it together. Hold it. Stay neutral. He starts to give you the, the inference, right or wrong, and you say, what evidence do you have to support that? Where in the text are you getting proof for that? Where did the author give you clues to help you make that aha? Uh -huh, ask those questions, but hold it together in a neutral position at the same time. Partially because when I had my, she's going to die, he's going to die, kid, every time, what do you think is going to happen? Someone's going to die. When that kid... Uh, I would say, now, why do you think someone's going to die? Look back in the text. I want evidence for why. And as soon as he would drop his head and look back into the text, he'd be like, okay, I don't think that because I can't find anything. And that's it. That's what I want. I mean, that was his Scooby-Doo reaction. Someone's going to die. But no, I, I want proof. Now, you ever have a kid who said,